and electric vehicle enthusiasts make room for NEO's latest release, the EC6. Stepping up from the previous generation's NT 1.0 platform, NEO has revamped and refreshed the EC6 using the new NT 2.0 platform. And the EC6's launch has everyone's attention, not just for its design, but also for its price tag. The model starts at a cool RMB 358,000, which is RMB 20,000, higher than its sibling, the ES6. However, for those interested in a MEO exclusive battery rental option, it's available for a slightly less startling figure of RMB 288,000, 236,900 euros. Now, every. And the much hyped launch event took an unconventional twist. While the company showcased the car in a distinct manner, NEO CEO William Lee's speech ended up playing second fiddle. Why the NEO said, you ask? Well, it seems the EC6 is crafted for a niche audience, diverging from the ES6's broader target, which NEO cannot afford to flop. Uh, spanning a uh, length of 48, 49 millimeter and a width of 1,995 millimeter. The vehicle stands at a height of 1,697, boasting a wheelbase of 2,915 millimeter, echoing the aesthetics of, of other NT 2.0 base models. Uh, the EC6 sports familiar taillights and headlights, and the same loof mounted LiDAR and camera setup. Not just a pretty face, uh, the EC6 houses dual electric motors. Um, Produced in Hefei, Anhui province, offering a maximum power of 150 kilowatts on 210 and 210 kilowatts in rear. These impressive numbers enable the EC6 to hit top speeds of 200 kilometers per hour. For reference, it's on par with the powertrain specs of the ES6, ET5, and ET5 Touring. If you're wondering about the battery options, NEO offers two, a 75 kilowatt hour standard range battery, with a 100 kilowatt hour long range pack, opting for the Bass's battery as a service model, and customers will face a lighter upfront cost of 36, 900 euros and monthly rental fees of 126 for the 75k for the 115 and the 200k slew of comfort features, including the enticing clean seat, which is a pricey add-on for the ES6. Uh, going back in time. Uh, the original EC6, built on the NT 1.0 platform, uh, was launched in late December 2019 with the first set of keys handed over to customers got in September 2020. This time around, Neo's taken up the pace. Delivery of the new EC6, it's happening today. Uh, no waiting games here. In a recent analyst call post their second quarter earnings announcement, NEO's management expressed optimism about their refreshed lineup. They're counting on their eight diverse products to cater to the most refined tastes of the premium market segment, aiming for a solid boost in overall deliveries. For context, the ES6 SUV, the company's star player and more in line by Chinese customers' preferences, and reported deliveries of 11,118 units in July and 8,601 units in August.